force consumers is people not understanding their actual role in society or their own freedom. Ruling class propagates false consciousness among the people in order to help themselves hold on to power. Ruling class ideology is essential for a ruling class. It becomes the basis of the false consciousness of the people who are oppressed by the state. Here are some examples of ruling class ideology. Liberalism is man's fullest attempt to reconcile the desires for individual liberty with the necessities of social organization. Inequality is fundamental and irrevocable. At some point we're going to have to defend this nation to keep the communists from taking away our freedom, our wealth, our entire system of free enterprise. To keep the economy going, we'll all have to tighten our belts a notch and raise the taxes. Your suffering and your patience and your pain is rewarded fully in God's goodness. False consciousness is people's rationalization for the exploitation and oppression that they experience in their daily lives. There are many examples of people's blindness to their lack of freedom and of their despair, which we call cynicism. We're not experts. We don't have the information to make all those decisions. So how can we even criticize them? If niggers get the jobs, there won't be any work for us. I don't have time to worry about these kinds of things. What with the house and the kids and shopping? You can't fight City Hall. Everything can't just be free. I'm in it for myself because you can't trust anyone. My parents worked hard. I worked hard. Why should they get anything without working for it? We're not the people. We're just spoiled middle class kids. Once you're old, all you do is sit around and wait to die. I'll move when it's really time to act. We're all trying to improve our professions. Little by little, it's getting better. We're so damaged, morally, psychologically, intellectually, that we can't struggle and we can't make a new society. In the end, any dreams about total freedom are just fantasies. Utopian thinking is irrelevant. You know you can't change anything out there until you really understand and accept yourself. I agree with your ends, but not your means. They have all the guns, we don't have anything. Good task, transform all false consciousness into true understanding and revolutionary action.